Look at that handsome man in that reflection. Oh, that's me. Oh, crap. Yeah, I want to show you something. So here's my awesome truck. Oops. Not Brutus, but Thunder. He's very dirty. It's a weird looking tongue, but put a tooth. Here we go. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I gotta clean. I did clean that truck. We've got the dually here. I was looking at one of these uh, cool dump box there. I like these things because they're short. It's a six seven power stroke. I find these are good looking truck, but they're uh, what I like about them. If I was doing like say I had a five or fifteen ton trailer behind it, whatever it pulls, it's the XLT, so. You could probably, eight foot box is good. That, that'd be cool to have a dumper. Uh, that's more gravel and stuff like that. But uh, I would have a pintle hitch in the middle, or a gooseneck in the middle and a fifth wheel. And then of course, they're just regular. Uh, probably have a, put a pintle on that too. So that's, what I like about it is with the rig cab, you got the eight foot box, you got the rig cab, but it's no longer than my truck there. Because when you have the extended cab with the diesels, it's like, well, you know, eight foot box. That's not an eight foot box there, but if it was the eight foot box plus that. You can see how much longer you'd be, right? So that'd be a good work truck. Uh, yeah. Let's go have a look at the, I got the whole series of uh, like all my motorized stuff called the Blue Speeder Project. And just to recap, that's the blue speeder that I didn't buy. Uh, it doesn't have the new, uh, the engine's out of it now. He's going to put a V8 in there, the guy in there. Uh, he, he's got it, so he's going to restore this thing. It's going to be, oh he, yeah, I see he's already started tearing some stuff out of it. But like the body and everything on this is good. It doesn't look the greatest, but uh, when it gets, uh, you see like it's, uh, there's a bit of rust in there, a little bit, a little bit of floor patches, but. I nearly bought that for 600 bucks, but uh, I don't have the place to work on it. But uh, yeah, so that's that, that's uh, the Sidero, Sidero, I think is the model. That was the four banger, but he's gonna put the V8 in there. So that's the Blue Speeder project. If, if you're we're wondering where I came up with the name for uh, that one, for with all my, you know, so I got like a road, you know, road rate bike. I got the Blue Speeder project, and then I got my speed model. But that's what I got to get next is a dually, a big ass trailer. See another Ram dually over here. The thing I like about the Rams is they got the Cummings diesel. That'd be cool. But yeah, here, uh, this got the oh, this got the six foot box. So, so about three times the price uh, to do everything. This is probably a scrapper, but. Uh, if I got one for cheap enough, that had just enough life in it to make its money back and a bit of profit, uh, it could be fun to have one of these. By a bit of money, I mean a shit ton of money. So Cummings Turbo Diesel, if it's the 12 valve or the 24 valve. Yeah. See, even the chrome on this bumper is uh, peeling too, just like mine. I guess it's just the age thing. Like the cow catcher on the front, eh? It's like there's a deer in the road. Good. <laughs> a moose in the road. Uh, concerned. <laughs> yeah, that wouldn't stop a moose. And then there's, of course, the awesome thunder. So I guess I'm going to get home. So, uh, not too bad. I made, uh, I thought I'd make between uh, 10 and 15 bucks. I made $19.20. <laughs> he gave me the extra 80 cents and just gave me a 20 flat. So not bad for about maybe all in 45 minutes work. Uh, mostly driving and whatever, you know, loading and unloading was probably maybe 20 minutes work. Uh, <laughs> but uh, he goes, I go, yeah, the extra 80 cents is because I'm handsome. He said, what? I said, yeah, I said, yeah. I said uh, you had to give me the extra 80 cents because I'm handsome. Well, we'll leave it at that. <laughs> it was funny. That was hilarious. I was like, what the hell? Uh, you gotta you gotta tease people once in a while and like you know like what the hell's going on here you know like, all right so time for thunder and i to go home so if i burnt a dollar of gas today i made twenty dollars off of that one 
little dollar of gas that I burnt. It is now hot in here. It's still 13 degrees outside. So I had 120 kilograms. So that's heavier than I thought. I thought I had about 200 pounds. So 120 kilograms, double it. So that's about uh, 240 pounds. So I think uh, I think most of the weight was that little head and, and the few, the the ballast or whatever because the tin the the tin doesn't weigh anything, right? Next up, there we go. All right, so now I gotta take the rest of the day off. Might clean up my truck. So it's supposed to rain this afternoon. It's supposed to rain all day tomorrow, but I gotta go back there and finish do, doing up those patches, make them ironclad, make them uh, bulletproof, right? So yeah, so a little bit of a hiccup today. Not bad. So, yeah. Yeah, so 20 bucks. Yeah. You know, and um, Alex was asking me, he goes, hey, Reg, why don't you just like save it up and bring it in in a good load? Well, the reason why I don't, I said, uh, number one, you load it, you offload it, you load it, you offload it. Like, I, I don't like to store it at home because number one, it gets messy and then you're doubling your work. Like, if it's a short little run like that, like, just get rid of it. Don't, don't, like, you don't make any extra money long term. You know what I mean? And you're going to spend more gas bringing it back again, right? So, just deal with it once. That's, that's my take, right? So, I get 20 bucks today. It's not very impressive. But if I get 20 bucks again tomorrow, the next day, the next day, by the end of the week, you got, uh, you know, like, a hundred uh two hundred dollars or something extra uh, you know end of the month you might make an extra thousand bucks you know at 20 bucks a shot or 40 bucks or you know if you get the like the other day where i got like three quarters of a ton strategically piled in the back i was amazed i got that much in the back um and uh, that was 92 bucks <laughs> you know what i mean so it's like just you know don't hang on to anything oh i gotta wait till the prices are higher just get rid of it there's always going to be more metal just get rid of it all right anyway that's uh yeah <laughs> like if you could use the the time frames of the videos as a kind of a reference point of how long it takes me to do something uh like this i drive from this place okay for five minutes or seven minutes or whatever and i go and i do this that and the other thing and uh, better take that in got my gas money got that Ugh. Make sure like doors are unlocked and uh, make sure you give thunder a, a thumbs up for being a good sport today like in his new oil he had a bit of a hiccup but not too bad he recovered he didn't stall out so that's good all right anyway i'm gonna leave it at that so yeah have yourselves a great day eh? <laughs>